Hello, this is Kurt from Grand Purpose Piano. You can reach us at grandpurpose.com. I'm here in a customer's house and I'm looking at the Wurlitzer console that they have. And I'm going to be giving this video to the customer so this way they can see what's going on. So right now the problem is, is that um, the keys are not repeating. Um, and you know the customer says that they're sticking keys. Um, there is a difference between sticking keys and keys that won't repeat. There's a lot of different um, problems that can occur. So right now I've determined that it's not the fact that the keys need to be rebushed. You know, there might be a little bit looseness here and there. I mean, there is some looseness, but the key is loose itself on the pinning, on the um, center pin and the front rail pin. So there's no problem there um, on all the keys. They're not sticking. Okay, so the problem is going to be this. The note when I play it will not repeat. So I'll play, it plays normally here, but when I go to repeat quickly, trying to lift my finger all the way up. I do another one. Okay. So now I'm going to set this down and I'm going to show you the fact that problem is, is that it's a weighing issue. There's a weight problem. Um, the piano is not properly weighed. Um, which balanced actually balances the better word um, the keys have very little weight in the back of the key not enough to help it to return back to its rest position so by taking this tool I just have a tool here there has some weight to it not a lot but so I'm going to sit this tool and just kind of stand it up on the back of the key and I'm going to do the same thing I did before This is without it. This is with it. Of course, the tool is bouncing up and down, so... So you could hear it repeats a, a tremendous amount better. So that's what I'm going to do right now, is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add a... Whoops. I'm going to analyze it a little bit more, and um, the piano needs some regulating. The springs need to be tightened in the action. <clears throat> needs to be gone through in that regard. But really, the problem is this. Let me take a key off, and let me just show you the look of the key. So here you have a nice key there, and then look at how much it tapers in the back. There's absolutely no weight whatsoever back in the back of the key. No weight, and it's. you can see this is the balance point. So you have this much of the key from this pin all the way to here, which is going to be very front heavy. And then you have the back, which really there's no weight whatsoever. Now that's not always a problem. I mean, visually you can see that there is no weight in the back of the key. They're supposed to have made this piano so that it has the proper ratio so that it will work and the keys will repeat properly. The problem with this piano is that the ratio, the key ratio is all off and you're having this problem with uh, repetition. All right, so I'll get back to you, the customer, and also for you, the person out there looking and watching this video. Um, this Hopefully this is helpful for you to determine um, some of the problems that are occurring with your piano if you're not getting good repetition. All right, thanks for visiting. This is Kurt at Grand Purpose Piano. You can reach us at grandpurpose.com.